Hello dear viewers today please watch how a closing spring of a circuit breaker is being charged This is a diagram of a spring charging circuit. This is roller type magnetic limit switch of two NC normally closed contacts. If compression is made on roller, the switch contacts get open. After completion of spring charge, both contacts get open during moving on and over a cam of breaker mechanism roller movement is controlled by cam of a circuit breaker mechanism during closing operation only first contacts of ls limit switch make or break connection between j3 and k85 to control LSX contactor. Second contact of LS make or break connection between J3 and K81 to control making or breaking of contractor 88M1 by which charging motor gets AC power or is disconnected from AC power after completion of charging. If closing spring is not being charged electrically, then first push the 88M1 contractor by an insulated screwdriver to make contact close and if motor started to run, then motor's AC powering circuit is ok. If motor is not run, then check continuity of 49M OLR overload relay between N15 and M3 and M12 and M2. Then check brass contacts if clear and clean. Finally check resistance of the motor. Previously check the availability of AC power in motor circuit if required. In spite of this, if motor is not run, check continuity between J3 and K81, check continuity between K71 and K81 of oiler contacts, show DC voltage in this circuit by making the MCB switch on, and hold multimeter between A1 and A2 of 88M1 to check voltage. If 220 volt is seen, then the coil of the side contractor has become opened. Replace the faulty 88M1 contractor by new one. If LSX circuit 
is seen defective. Closing circuit of circuit breaker will not be opened during spring charging and spring charging indication will be shown although spring is not charged. Thank you for watching this video.